my line of work make you uncomfortable, Precious? No. Just that you felt like you had to use it to hurt me. I've been where you've been. Ha. Where is that? <laughs> you wouldn't believe me if I told you. <laughs> I don't know people always say that. that you wouldn't believe me, but in this case, it's not even worth trying. It's I never thought you would. That's why I never bothered to tell a soul until now, and I never will again. I'm the only person you've told. That's a great line. Does that make other girls wet? Do they actually eat up that bullshit? You know, I could give a shit whether you believe me or not. I mean, frankly, I'm too tired to prove it to you. So. Oh, there's proof now, huh? How else would I know that you have twin moles on your inner thigh? Anyone with 50 bucks could tell you that. Okay. Forget that. How about the fact that you prefer the smell of skunk to flowers? Or that you hate cilantro? Because for some reason unknown to you, it reminds you of your stepsister. Or that when you have an orgasm, your toes go numb. I'm sure all your clientele are privy to that. I just thought you should know. Know what? That you were happy once. With me. You know, there's one major hole in your story. There's no fucking way on this planet or any other I would ever be in some fucking sorority. You were happy then. Oh, you crying. You sure you don't know your what? No, I don't need it when I'm going. Well, you'll have to change everyone else's life again, is that it? Maybe next time you'll pop up in some mansion while I end up in Tijuana doing some donkey act. You know what? I'm over it. Every time I try to help someone, everything just goes to shit. Well, don't give up now, Slick. Hell, you've already done so much for me. Why don't you go back in time and save Mrs. Halpern and her baby? And then maybe Lenny wouldn't freak out and ruin my family. No, go back to when I'm seven and fuck me in front of my daddy's video camera. Straighten me out a bit. <laughs>